All right, so I picked up $28 in nickels from the bank. Um, I only got $28 because that's how much money I have right now. But I was pretty surprised that there's four different kinds of rolls. You know, I'm glad they weren't all of these because normally these have mostly newer coins. But it doesn't look like the brand new Jefferson, so that's good. Because that happened when I got, uh, when I went penny roll hunting and they were just all 2013 pennies. Then you got, you know, your average rolls like these and then your normal home rolls. So if I find anything good, I'll keep you all posted. On my second roll in, I got 1941. Awesome. And I got a 1961. That's pretty good. On my first roll, I didn't get much. So I was getting kind of, you know, I was like, dang. But 1941 works good enough for me. Okay, so I'm done with these kind of rolls. I still got about that much left. And those are the nickels I've gone through. So, about the last four, three rolls is all I got. I got 1946 D, the mint marks on the back so you can't see it. A really nice 1947 S, and a fair 1954S. So I'm pretty stoked that these two have S mint marks because, you know, generally the San Francisco mint is better. So pretty good with these finds. I thought these would be the bad rolls. Turned out to be pretty good. Wondering what these rolls have, so keep y'all posted. Well, I've done about four rolls. And so far, 1960 is the oldest coin I've found. So I'm starting to come to the conclusion that anything that you can roll at home, but there's a coin roll hunter that went to the bank I got and he just cashed these in. And these came from like the Federal Reserve and they had, you know, coins that slipped through people's hands, the old ones. So those have the good ones. I'm pretty sure these are all new. I hope I'm wrong, but uh, this kind of sucks. All right, guys, these are my finds. Well, actually, they're not all my finds. I'm not keeping all of them, that's for sure. I'm only keeping the old ones. Even if some of them are old, they're not old enough for me. So, we'll start off with the newest. See if we can get this stupid iPhone to focus. All right, and that is a 1966. I'm not keeping that. The next we have is a 1965. Not really in good condition, either of them. To prove a point, they made a buttload of 1964 nickels. I got like 15 of them right there. Uh, I don't know if this is true or not, but yesterday I read on the internet that they made them through 1966. But just, they have 1964 on them, which is kind of stupid. I don't even know if that's true, but still. They made like 1.7 billion of them, I think. So, I'm definitely not keeping those. Next find we have, 1963, I'm not keeping that. I'm not keeping them until they get into the 50s, that's actually for sure. Next, 1962, got a pair of those. We have another pair of 1961s. Alright, um, I might keep this. 1960, if I can get it to focus. It's not uncirculated, but it's definitely an AU condition. Alright, so now the ones I'm keeping, 1954. I'm pretty sure that has an S mint mark. Uh, you can't see that, but it is an S. Next find we have, 1948. plain made from the Philadelphia mint next find let's get this stupid phone to focus 1947 and it is from the San Francisco mint I don't think you can see the mint mark but yes it is um next find 19 Ah, come on, stupid phone. 
1946. If it was 1945, it would be silver. But, oh well. One year. Missed it by one year. That's my luck. But still. Awesome find. And it is from the Denver Mint. It has a nice mint mark. I'm sure you can see it if you know where it's located. It's located right there. Oldest coin of the day? 1941. First old coin I found out of the rolls I had today. Um, so, all in all, I'm keeping everything on the top row. I was just kind of showing you what you get in the 60s on the bottom row. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with my finds. By this weekend, I'm going to upload another video. I don't know if I'm going to coin roll hunt. I'm, I don't know if I'm going to go to my coin shop. It'll be something with coins. Anyways, thanks for subscribing and watching. See you later.